to the next group of hills. And we should probably just give up and go to Bone Hill first. Next chance we get. What a name. Is that because you go up there and you get boned? No. I mean, literally, you go up there fight and they beat no, the hell out of you? that's where the bones are, the, the undead. Oh, you're up by Tritop, right? No. No? Ready Forest, you said, remember? Ready Forest, yeah, okay. Here. Uh, I talked to the lady down there. Uh, garden people. So we're still playing D&D. And &D. my head hurts. And his head hurts. He didn't catch himself in a zipper, so don't worry. But we're still doing it. But I'm going to show you a few things while we're here. Okay. So... This here is the Monster Manual. It's been a long time, but this is Advanced D&D &D Monster Manual. Look how old the book is. I mean, look, it's black and white. What does that tell you? They're on the same page. They're not racist. They get along. Uh. Then we got the Dungeon Master Guide. See, it's duct tape. That's how old it is. Oh, that's on the juicy side. All kinds of stuff. And then the Player's Handbook. Right. And then we have the dice. You got a percentile dice for percentage. You've got D6, which are regular dice. We play craps. You've got a D8, eight sided dice. Then you've got a D12. Now, a long time ago, I had a D100. It wouldn't stop rolling, so I threw it away. Then I have a D20, 20-sided 20 dice. Yeah, you're right. These are just general dice. Mm -hmm. And a D4, 4-sided dice. Is sparked. What's that, Robert? General nastiness is in this area. All right. Then tomorrow morning, we that's where we'll go. And these so are the figurines. Nasties. Okay. That's that one. And that's that one. And what are you going to do when you're in town down there? Just grab a... Yeah, I can do that. Uh, wait a minute. They have to charge. Ken, hmm? you need to put yourself in a square. Not in four squares. I didn't put myself there. Well, pick one of the four squares to be in. Okay. Alright. 25, 30. Uh, they both can charge and whack on you. Alright. <sighs> What's your armor class, Ken? We never figured that out. See these guys? They're dead. They're dead. He's dead. And he's dead. Well, that one's a she, but never mind. That's a she. Okay, I'll be back in a minute. Um, you can see a square dais of seven steps atop which is a lectern. Mm -hmm. uh, screw that up a while. Uh, resting on a lectern is a closed book. So I take it this is a setup they want us to grab the book. There are four three foot square tables arranged in a square around the top of the dais. Told you it was kind of nerdy. Back later. It looks like a 53 inches tall, 110 pounds, brown hair, brown eyes. Human. Alright, so what are the rest of them doing this in their, for their action this round? Alright. Well, he's done his thing. Mm -hmm. Alright, they need... Uh, 16 to hit you, Mike? 12. 12. Two misses. Oh, big time. 
user. 15. I missed. Is it my turn or your turn? Well, you and Jerry go next. So okay. Doesn't really matter. What we're Okay, now I have to come forward. You have to move forward. Or I can go Pull one, sword two, and, and hit him, right? Yeah, you can do that. Okay, both of that person. 17 and... It's two hits. Two hits. So I roll 2d6. Eight points. Good. <coughs> Next round. Uh, d6. One. I rolled a six. I rolled a four. Yeah, we're still at it. He's still inside. He's packing a few stuff. I pack the rest. So, this is me out of breath outside. We just finished had a gaming thing. Awesome. Good time. D&D &D original. No D&D &D second or third. Or 3.5 or 3.0, D&D 1, first one. Had a good time. It was all right. Just carrying things to the car when you're overweight. Out of breath. I tell you. Let's see. What? Here he comes. Here's what's left in me, cups. See? Fat people get out of breath easily. Because we're carrying all this damn weight. You're right, but we put it in the car and we're still out of breath. So going into the car, heading home. Then we're going to edit this and see what goes from there. Talk to you in a minute.